Hello and welcome to Sammy's Tropical Garden, coming to you from Southern California. If you guys are wondering why I have all these rashes on my arms and all that is because I had allergic to reactions to one of my medications. So that's why I haven't wanted to post for a day and a half because it just happened overnight and yeah, so I kind of got a rash and I don't look as best in shape right now. But today, I'm going over a Calpiter update. I had to leave my monarch in California. He's on some milkweed out there, um, so that's good. But he should get fat and make a monarch soon, so that's super fun. So, I made it back to Louisiana, if you saw in the last video. I don't know why someone put a down like in one of my videos. It's like, look, my plants are perfectly fine. Like, see, like, literally, they made it in the suitcase fine. So like there's all the milkweed and my passion vine up there and all my other plants on this row. So they are doing great, but let's just go over to cow pitters today. I do have spice bush fall tails. I have a monarch. They're all eggs right now. So this is just a short little video of my raising things up, my raising monarchs and cow pitters today. And yes, this is the, gonna be the last brew for this season, so. There's one egg. See it up there? Look how cute. That's a spice bush. And we do have a lot of camphor trees around here where I'm staying right now. So that's a good sign that there's going to be a lot of butterflies here. A lot of pelominis and a lot of spice bush. Yesterday I did see a spice bush laying your eggs and that's how I got these cow butter, I mean, these eggs. So there's the other egg right there. As you can see, hold on, I got two, oops, I got two eggs. How cute is that? I got maybe a brother or sister, a brother and brother, or girl and girl. I hope it's a like brother and sister so that way they can mate and have more. That would be awesome. That would be amazing. So if they were, that would be amazing because I could have more eggs. And here's a monarch, just a single little egg of a monarch. See it up there with the dirt? Hold on, I zoom it in. Let me see if you can see it. It's basically right there. And yes, my back did go out last night because I slept on it the wrong way. I've been staying on the couch and yeah, it's seven o'clock out here and I had to wake up so early. My back was just like, ow. So it's it's kind of getting better, but not really. So this will be my last video until tomorrow because hopefully I find some more eggs and more cow putters around here. There's a lot of host plants around here for butterflies. Like there's some, um, I, of course, I got the milkweed. I'm the only one that got the milkweed. There's oak trees for the owl. The Not owl. No. The owl is in South America. So there's the oak trees for the moths. And I got um, some more plants. There's some other plants down there in the water area where I usually find eastern tigers. And yesterday I saw a big giant saltail. At least like seven inches. That's rare to find a seven inch eastern tiger swallowtail here but they're no um giant swallowtail so yeah that's that's what i've been pretty much seeing i saw a dark morph eastern tiger yesterday a dark uh, spice bush laying her eggs that's how i got these eggs they are fresh eggs so they should emerge very soon so i'm looking all around because all the cars are lining up because there's a school over here so it's interesting to watch people go to school and like I'm not in school yet because we just moved back here. I'm starting school in a few days, so that's why this is not my temp this is not my permanent house. We're staying at a friend's house until we find our house. And then I'm going to school and then that's why I'm not gonna be posting as much while I'm at school. So hopefully by the time I get off school it's like three or four o'clock until I'm able to post. So I might be tired after school sometimes and stuff like that. So s school here in Louisiana is already starting back up. Uh, that's amazing. But see, California, the school hasn't started there. But anyways, that's all for now. Here's here at Tropical Garden. That's why I'm not in school yet because we just moved. Not this house, but another house somewhere it's from here. So this is just a temporary house where I'm keeping all my plants. And look, I have to start all over again. It's from that guy that stole all of my plants and everything. Yeah, so we're basically going to start all over. And, well, we got new furniture, but just got to get more plants. Sadly. Luckily, I got some plants I love. 
But hopefully I do get my other plants back. I hope so. So I'm sorry I'm just rambling, rambling on. It's so early this morning, my back is out. And yes, I got all these bumps. Don't know why from the allergic reaction. But say goodbye to these caterpillars. I mean, eggs. And they should emerge in a few days. I'll let you know when they emerge. So sorry I'm rambling on. That's all for now, Anne's Down Tropical Garden. Hopefully you watch this video so that we can know where I am and how I've been doing and all that. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching. See you next episode. Like and subscribe and comment. Bye-bye. Please don't put any down likes. I don't need that right now. Bye.